All right, welcome back folks and we're going to talk about tropics here. We have tropical storm Idalia, which is down here in the uh, Caribbean. It is just off the uh, Yucatan Peninsula, just to the west of Cuba, 50 miles south southwest of the of the western tip of Cuba. We're going to get a new advisory at five o'clock on this. So this is still from the two o'clock advisory. But notice that big poof of clouds right there in the center. That's uh, convection. So the storm is strengthening, continuing to strengthen just five miles an hour, five miles per hour away from category one hurricane strength. Strength. This is the forecast track from the Hurricane Center coming up into the Gulf and becoming a major hurricane. That is a Category 3 hurricane as it makes landfall uh, pretty much along the Big Bend area of Florida. Notice we already have uh, the uh, the watches and warnings uh, already up for the Gulf Coast of Florida as this continues to move on out towards the Atlantic and uh, going out towards uh, Bermuda as we go into the later part of the week. But look at how much rain Florida could pick up here. Yeah, we could be looking at about a good 8, 10, maybe even more inches, mainly across the northern section of Florida where we see the eye wall potentially making its landfall. So really heavy rain and gusty winds are going to be likely, but that's not the only thing going on. We have Hurricane Franklin now a major category four. Look at that well defined eye right in the center the circulation. This is mesmerizing to look at, and uh, this is also going to be impacting Bermuda. They've got a one two punch here. This is going to be moving to the west of Bermuda, but still they're going to be feeling impacts from this because remember the cone only shows you the potential center of the storm, not the entire width. So again, uh, impacts from tropical systems can spread several hundred miles away from the storm center and look at how far this thing goes. It's going to go all the way up towards Nova Scotia and all the way over across to our friends all the way on the other side of the pond and it's going to maintain its hurricane strength. It's going to become a post tropical hurricane by that point, but still it's going to be carrying some pretty strong winds and some heavy rain. Karen, Amanda.